All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of A Plague Tale. I hope you guys all have been well, and I hope that you guys are enjoying this series as well. I'm absolutely loving it, and I can't wait to play it. I've just been, like, sort of looking forward to this all day. This is a puzzle to the tower, and let's just see if we can figure it out. Hopefully it won't be too, too hard. So far, the strategy has been, like, straightforward. You just got to sort of think a lot. Locked. Alright, so I've got no idea actually what I'm maybe supposed to be doing here. I'm not even going to try and guess. So I can't go that way, I can't go this way. That is really weird. There's a door here. Alright, oh, we it? can pick lock it. Yes. This thing's really old. Oh, there was something alive in it. It's open. Apparently those locks are like really easy to defeat. Um, those old school tumbler locks. They all decided to meet here, it seems. So we can get the rats to move. Lucas, Hugo, stay out of the rain. We'll open up a path to the tower. All right. Come, Hugo. Ready, Melly? As long as we get them out of the way. So it seems like in how like we done in the last episode, we just gotta push this car thing. Come. The siege of Chateau d'Ambrage. Two girls versus thousands of rats. This battle will go down in history. <gasps> Look, they're moving. And there's a there's a stick down there as well. So I think we've got to carry the stick to the um, fireplace. Mm. Hopefully, it won't be too hard. We should be able to reach the central section now. Yes, that's a good first step. I'll let you go first, because rats are your thing. <laughs> Thanks a lot. As much as I like talking over and stuff like that. Um, like I just I'm with you. great I feel better already I honestly just want to like shut the hell up and just play the game and enjoy it so if I'm not talking too much guys it's not because I'm not in the mood I'm just to push that I'm just honestly really excited to play this and I really want to sort of like get deep into it <laughs> that's kind of cool. Not sure if this type of technology existed back in well, these days. I guess that's what the pit's for. Uh, the bracy is coming back by itself. Melly, can you get to me? I'm coming. Can't wait to get up there. Look at them. Swarming like nobles at the king's court. But it's our castle. <laughs> So I think we just gotta right. swing this thing around. Those ones have to be driven into the pit too. And of course they're on the wrong side of the brazier. I'm gonna have to go down and see what's there. Alright, I'll cover you with the brazier. Um What? Can I light this on fire? I'm putting my life in your hands, you know. All in a day's work, my lady. Whenever you're ready. All right, so Melly's gonna turn it. All right, when you're ready, man. Can you take care of it? All right. Wow. It could do with a bit of grease. <laughs> Would you rather be down here? I'm fine. I'm just warming up. I'm at the end. What do you see? More braziers. I can get up on the ramparts. Go on then. We're going to make it. Hugo will be safe. We'll all be safe. What the hell am I supposed to do? I have no idea. I think that's right. But now I can't push it. Can I go up here? See, I think she could easily make that. That doesn't make any sense to me. Here we go. Melly, 
I'm clearing the outer area. They're coming your way. All right. There are so many of them. We'll never clear a path that way. Right. We need to clear the whole courtyard. <sighs> Let's get on with it then. I'm already soaked anyway. I think she should try and like release it. So the rats go back out into the pit. There we go. Perfect. Suck on that. The last sector now. I have to get back to the ladder. <laughs> Goodbye, rats. <sighs> Not so tough now, are ya? That's a bit better. you want alley -oop. <laughs> the bridge we better lower it and so Misia the Amazon and Meli the stealthy <laughs> conquered the Chateau d'Ambrage huh. you've read too many books I come on we still have to clean up the area down there we're going to need the brazier from the ramparts. I'll cover you with this one. All right, off you go. Uh, what is it? Nothing. It's just a crappy old lever. I think it's going to release. You always know the right thing to say. It's going to be all right. It's your castle. You have a connection. Our castle. Imagine, we could all live here together. I'm more of a Stella girl, you know. How am I going to get up there? You'll need a ladder. Everywhere. I don't know Amicia the Amazon. Tell them Very funny. Amicia the Amazon. Right. I didn't get it. And what is like what do you mean by Amazon? Amazon.com? <laughs> oh that, that was kind of lame, I that was really lame. I feel kind of ashamed. <laughs> Can we just go through the door? Uh, closed. Alright, maybe we've got to wait for everyone else. It's kind of annoying because, like, I think we've got to do that whole thing again. Of, like, bringing uh, what the last part we just did. I might even cut these out, guys. Dragon. There we go. There we go. Oh, yuck. We did it. We pushed them back. The castle saved our lives. Yes. Laurentius was right. To celebrate our victory, would you mind if we get out of the rain, please? Right. To the tower. Yes. Come over to the fire and warm up. It's huge. We'll have time to explore tomorrow. This is our home now. All right, chapter eight, our home. Having a 
bad dream. Uh, oh, are you... Are you awake already? Yes, I found lots and lots and lots of things. Come and see, you'll really like them. All right. Come on, come on. What's that noise? It's Lucas. Follow me. You'll see. Right. This will wake me up. Hopefully. Down here. Oh, this would be so cool, man. I'm kind of really enjoying this story right now. It's like... The sun dominates the moon instead of complimenting it. Lucas! Oh, there you are. Sleep well? Not a wink. This laboratory's in bad shape. But it inspired me. I'm on the brink of completing the great work. And you... You can help me. Oh, yes, yes. What do we have to do? Amicia, I need the file from the left-hand table. Uh, all right. On me, on me. What can I do? We need light for the last step. Hugo, go get a candle. I can do that. Uh, is it this table? I don't know. I'm just sort of going around looting everything. Oh, I, that must be it. <laughs> We got it, we got it. <laughs> Alchemist lived here. Maybe Laurentius too. So what were like alchemists back in the day? I think they were like pharmacists or something like that. Like, or, I don't know, obviously someone who worked with chemicals, I think. Like a modern, like a early day sort of pharmacist. I think that's what an alchemist is. Here, I don't really anything know. Anything else? Uh, yes, a concentrated laurel sap. It's just behind me. I'll get it. What's a great work? Can I eat it? It is the elixir that would illuminate your path. A beacon for the bearer of the macula. It came to me during the night. So I just want to say, I don't know if you guys can hear the stringed instrument in the back. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry if you guys find this gameplay boring, but it really means a lot to me. Like, the stringed instruments in the back, I feel like it's so well done. Um, I researched it and it's like a mixture of like the lute and a classical guitar, which is honestly just awesome like I love that here good so the angel's tear the pinnacle of alchemy the elixir wow the great work uh it wasn't supposed to do that oh. it doesn't matter Lucas perhaps we uh, should let you rest right Hugo well done, Lucas. You're a sorcerer. Amicia, come on. I'm coming. He's such a cute kid, man. I, I really like Hugo. Hopefully, nothing. I really hope nothing happens to him. And like, he probably doesn't understand like all this stuffs happening with him. Like, he's, or maybe he's old enough. I don't know how old is he supposed to be. Like six. By the way, have you seen Melly? No. Uh, she's, maybe she's already gone. Oh no, I wanted to say goodbye to her. Yo, this place has so much loot, man. I need a bigger pouch. This castle must have been empty for centuries. I'll construct this. Maybe I should construct a few things so I can pick them up. Come on, Amicia. Let's wow. both do it. <laughs> Having fun, are you? I'm sure the Inquisition are too. Melly, we thought you'd gone. Come on, we need to talk. Holy shit, man! This place is so washed out. Like my screen is like all white. I need a better TV. <laughs> What's the matter? This castle is a ruin. Ah, and that's exactly what you need. Whoever built this place really didn't want to be fucked with. Be good, and you'll be fine. So, you're going to find Arthur. If I can help, he's my problem. You heard what I heard. Those Inquisition dogs took him to the Bastion. I know where to look. I'll find him. Amicia, look! Listen, with Hugo, it doesn't look easy, but believe me, it's worth it. He will save you. They always end up saving us. Even if, you know, brothers, sometimes you just want to kill them. The symbol is Amicia. I believe you. Anyway, don't leave without saying goodbye. <laughs> As if that was my style. Amicia, please come. Yes, Hugo. What did you find? 
What do you got, Hugo? It's the drawing. What drawing? The one in the dining room. I'll show you. Come on. I'm following you. I think we should really go help um help Melly. Like find Bastion. Or Arthur or whatever his name is. Oh shit, where did he go? An alchemist crucible. Lucas will be happy. Look, it's the same symbols. You're right. Alchemist coat of arms, maybe? Have you seen the tree? The tree? Come on, over here. Why do I feel like this is leading to something? <laughs> oh, yeah, look at the loot. <laughs> <laughs> Come back. Where are you going? <laughs> you found new friends. Yes. find a way to cure you and there's Lucas and Melly now you know Lucas come see the butterflies looks like someone's having a good time <laughs> The carrier may be lost. How much time do we have? Very little. Hugo is nearing the first threshold. My master and your mother were trying to slow the process down. But how? What were they doing? They were working on a very complex elixir that would allow him time to prepare. And do you know how to do it? I don't have their knowledge, but their work was inspired by a forbidden book. The Sanguinis Itinera. So perhaps with the book? I'm afraid could... not. The Sanguinis Itinera is dangerous. It is sealed together with other works in the university basement. Just getting there would be near impossible. Suicidal even. Normally, yes. But if we take advantage of the current chaos, we might have a chance. I know the place. It's in town not far from where they keep my brother. If you're ready to take that risk, I can help you get in. Thank you. Right. I'll get my belongings together. Meet me inside when you want to leave. In that case, you'll need some equipment. I'll get it ready. Hugo? I'm really sorry. I need to leave. Don't worry. I'll stay with Lucas. Good. I'll be back soon. Alright, so we're gonna go off without Hugo. I don't know, man. I kind of feel a bit worried leaving him alone. We'll have to patch up these straw mattresses. <laughs> At last. All right, come on. Here. And one last thing. Laurenti has told me once that there are roses scattered along the path to the book. So keep your eyes open. Roses. All right, we will. Lucas is such an intelligent kid. All right, in the shadow of ramparts. This seems like it's just, the story is just really coming together nicely. I, I just can't say it enough. The first rule of survival is hidden between the legs. Wouldn't the head be quicker? You're way too soft. Shh, there are the town ramparts. Oh, wow. 
That is amazing. Look at that. You know, I've always wanted to like check out castles in Europe and stuff. That'd be so sick. What's that crowd on the bridge? It's the townsfolk. They're being evacuated. Let me guess. The bite's here. Exactly. And where there's the bite, you'll also find the Inquisition. Aren't you the smart one? No. Did you know him? A thief. I used to work with him. He was gifted. So that's the punishment for stealing. Death. I don't want to find Arthur with that kind of collar. Come on. Let's go. Shit. You know, I completely forgot, like, back in the medieval times, like, all this sort of stuff. Um, yeah, man, it was a brutal era. Melly, can you look? I'll open this. Then I'll go take care of Arthur. I actually right. learned lock picking so, once. Where will I find the university? It's the big building at the other end. You can't miss it. Do you think we'll see each other again? I hope so. You owe me. Shit. Let me tell I you, it's not as easy as it looks. <laughs> I'll do my best. There you go. Go on. Get going. Good luck. You too. All right, here we go. They know they'll die if they stay here, but you think they'll leave of their own accord? Come on, get a move on. We have to get the last ones out. Don't worry, we're almost done. I'm like worried I'm gonna get caught right now. If you're wondering why I'm quiet, I'm like on the edge of my seat. <laughs> It's a little bit too quiet, I don't like it. Wow. Over there. That must be the university. Wow. Mm. All that light. I don't like this. Look at this. This is just... Wow. This is... This is honestly incredible, man. I... When I... I honestly did not expect this game to be like this. Like I thought it was Right. It's a way off. But you can do this. Here we go. I really like I really hope they don't do a remake on the PS5 version because like I kinda hate the graphics and I'm gonna really hey, you in there. be upset. This is your last warning before we drag you out on your ass! What? Something moved, I think. Ah, oh, shit. I really hope it doesn't come out this through this way. I don't think he is. Nothing. Yeah, if they make it on like PS5, I'm gonna be so annoyed because like I really wanted to play this game with high graphics. I saw it on PC and I thought PS4 was gonna look like it and um, yeah, unfortunately not. I don't know where the other guy went. I think he maybe went this way. Careful. Last call! By order of the Grand Inquisitor Vitalis, Mountain Law is enforced, and the city under the control of the Inquisition. Any people who choose to remain will be arrested and executed. Martial Law. Unbelievable. Why now? I think I might have to knock his helmet off. Over there. What's that? Goodbye. Oh shit. Oh no, I probably should have killed him like further out so they eat his body. Alright, I'm kind of. I honestly don't know how to get across now. 
Unless, can I take this down? Maybe I can throw a rock at it. No. Nah. Alright, I'm gonna have to use one of these things. Alright, made it. Yeah, I don't like using this because it takes up so many things. This better have been the way we gotta go as well. Oh shit! Oh shit. Alright, yo, get out. Luckily I had that in reserve, man. This thing... It's a game changer. My flashbang. See if you can mix up with all these rats around your feet. You are... <laughs> oh, yeah. He's gone. Anyways, I'm going to continue this on in the next episode, guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I'm, gonna make sure I don't I'm absolutely like loving it. And please go ahead and smash that like button. Comment below what your thoughts are. Let me know if you guys like this episode. It really helps me out. Uh, it really helps engagement, a lot of things. And subscribe if you guys want to keep uh, up to date with all this content as well. If you guys haven't already, it really mean a lot. Anyways, I'm going to end the episode here before that guy catches me. <laughs> it's increasing my blood pressure right now. Anyways, I'll see you guys very soon. Take care. Bye.